awesome you can move your head around look backwards look left look right look up look down and that's great isn't it How's it going guys? Welcome to another video of Hillsim Gaming. And if you are new on this channel, don't forget to subscribe, hit that bell icon so you don't miss any further videos that I'll be producing on this channel. There will be gameplays, there will be tutorials and lots of stuff. Without any further ado, let's start the video. So in this video, I'll be showing how to install head tracking device or enable head tracking or you can mimic Toby head tracking without any expensive uh, equipment. This will help you enable head tracking in ETS2, ATS2 games and you can use your head tracking while moving in the truck. So look left, right, up, down or front or back. This is a lot, a lot helpful and useful tool and also it brings a little bit of more realism in the game. So you can you know, enjoy the simulative version of the game as more and more. For this one you need to have a configuration file that the the link of this file you'll find that in the description of this video i'll put that in there this configuration file is only for your you may say convenience this will help you to to set all the settings all the uh, sensitivity settings for the camera controls for the head movement that you have to play or set by yourself um, it, it takes a lot trust me it takes a lot and also you need to have this face track ir noir software that software will be also included in the description, I guess. If you want it, you can let me know. Uh, but this is a free software, you can find it on Google. That's pretty much it. You need nothing, no, nothing special equipment. And also, you need to have a webcam. Obviously, you need to have a webcam that can track your head movement precisely. Not, not so much heavy stuff, but I'm using this time my Logitech C930E and if you have a similar or a better version or maybe a lower version that can work so it depends on the settings and stuff you like to see so yeah uh, there will be another um, um, hopefully there will be another version of this tutorial where you can use your cell phone as a webcam on your computer and your cell phone will track your head tra head movement and it will mimic in the game as you are moving your head so yeah that will be also part of this tutorial and will be uploaded on the channel so if you don't want to miss that uh, please don't forget to subscribe you need to install the software which is face track nowhere you have to download it and install it wherever you like and after installing what's the first step the first step is that you have to copy this configuration file and click on face track nowhere right click and then go to settings and then paste it i've already here then i can skip it but you have to paste it in the settings folder of the face track noir software we are using after that it is there now you can run the software itself as you can see it is loaded in my profile but you have to load it yourself so click on load go to settings find that file click open it will be loaded in this file and click save so it will be saved in this in configuration file next thing is that you have to adjust your smoothness i prefer it on one you can see where you find it fit you can change uh, as per your liking but it, in my case it's on one you can invert or set uh, your pitch and roll i don't like to invert my yaw or roll i like to invert my pitch so it'll be checked the others are unchecked you can set it as you want the shortcut keys you can select any one if you want and also you can copy my settings as well the rest setting you have to you know copy it uh, all these settings you have to copy these i'll open them one by one to show you what settings i am using so you, you have to you know select tracker source face api click the settings don't forget to you know select your device which device you're using as your webcam uh, in my case obviously i'm using uh, logitech webcam c930e you can see clearly you can also do camera settings here or the adjustments i'm not opening it because it's not the face real time and you have to you know uh, enable these axes whichever axis you want to use obviously you want to use all the axes don't forget to you know click on this and click save okay and the filter it has to be set on slr filter mk2 
and you don't have to change any settings it will be in the uh, I guess in the Dropper of the file I will share and if it is not don't do not set it also the next is the game protocol you have to set free track 2.1 go to settings and make sure you have this file checked and enable both and you don't have to look at the DLL file just leave it there and press ok or save after that uh, make sure you have here none and none here as well and that takes it all that was all you have to do with the face track noir now the one last thing you have to do is uh, in the game you uh, either it is ats2 or ats you have to uh, go in the settings and do one setting let's get in the game and see what setting we want to do so we are the menu and you don't have to start the game to do that setting but obviously if you want to see how the hand track moves you have to be in the game so i'm just uh, showing you the setting first and then we'll be in the game later on so go to options and keys and all the way down to others section this is walk mode and this is other here you will find enable head tracking enable head tracking you need to have a button a key uh, configured here to enable or disable head tracking while in the game to enable you have to press that key and after that uh, after you enable head tracking it will track your head movement through uh, the software we have set and once you have disabled it you can use your mouse to you know see left right up down or anywhere you want to see the other button that says reset head tracking you can configure it as well this will you know reset the settings to normal and center it down as well so these are useful you have to set any key here in my case i've set this and this key um, and let's get back get into the game and see how it works so as you can see we are in the game and uh, inside our truck and this movement is clearly by my mouse you can see uh, how it moves and how it looks you have to use your mouse every time you want to see left right up down and you cannot go front or back the uh, motion sensors or you may say the head track will enable us to uh, look ahead of us or get backwards or go left and right or up or down that's a fun time and it also brings realism or to our game so let's do it for that you have to first I'm gonna now enable head tracking through the face track noise software for that you have to go to your software and click on start when we click on start it will uh, brings up this camera angle here and show us if it is tracking or not so we are clicking on start wait for it okay as you can see it says tracking and all the uh, x y z movements raw inputs you can see the picture all around it uh, as my head moves so it is tracking now now you have to minimize this one and get into the game as you can see we are currently on the mouse movements and it's not that smooth and you have to use mouse every time if you're playing with steering wheel and some stuff you have to use your mouse and you know let go the steering wheel for a while to see left and right is but while head tracking is enabled you can you know look like that by just moving your head around i'm just enabling it in like next three two one go it is enabled how cool is that now i'm looking left i'm looking right i'm looking up i'm looking down i'm looking forwards i'm looking backwards how cool is that i'm liking it this is great stuff there are lots of tutorials on the youtube you can find any of those but this is the one that i find greatly helpful and pretty fast no more fancy stuff no more softwares you need one software and your game and a webcam to run this there will be an uh, tutorial with the mobile version as well i'll upload that soon as you can see it's awesome you can move your head around look backwards look left look right look up look down and that's great isn't it so hopefully you liked it 
And don't forget to subscribe to the channel, click on notification bell and like the video, share with your friends and comment down, tell me how it went, if it helped you and also if you have any problems you can share with it. I'll try to help you as soon as possible. See you in the next one. Till then, take care and happy gaming.